Modern Warfare 2. All right, I lied to you. I didn't platinum the new Modern Warfare 2, but the first game I ever platinumed was Modern Warfare 2 from 2009. However, I did just 100% Steam achievement the new Modern Warfare 2. I know, it doesn't have the same ring to it, which is why I said platinum did. What? I didn't want to break out my PS4, which I sit on my TV stand for aesthetics only, and I definitely didn't want to buy a $400 PS5 that I probably would never use because I have a PC. So instead I spent $50 to get a second copy of Modern Warfare 2 from Steam. After spending $100 on the Vault Edition copy, already on Battle.net. What? I'm doing it for the content, and so I can have this happen. Sorry, I meant this. Alright, let me back up a little bit. Before we start, we should talk about the types of challenges there are in this remake, reboot, sequel. There are two steps to platinuming this game. First off, this is one of the best COD campaigns and has been out for five months. If you haven't played it yet, I'm sorry, but there are spoilers. The campaign is the beast of this game with 18 unique trophies to gather clearly holding the majority of the 25 total trophies. Two of these trophies require you to beat the campaign, one on any difficulty and one on veteran or realism difficulty. To kill two birds with one stone, I played this all on veteran. Seven, you in position? Nearly there. So starting out, we loaded into the prettiest looking scene in the entire game. We used this death rocket to blow up this dude and his evil henchmen. Copy approved. Send it. Once we get done with that, Laswell and the new Wish.com General Shepard find out that the second in command of that guy we just blew up is pretty ticked off about them doing that. So they send a team to go grab him. Let's get ourselves a win, yeah, LT. Save your seat, sir. Fucking hell. Cue one of the hardest lines by Ghost yet, and then a literal horror movie of a mission. But this is capture or kill. Got you back. Steaming Jesus. Can we just take a second and appreciate Soap's one-liners and quips? The big bad Hassan escapes, but they find that his forces have something else up their sleeve. Negative. We found a weapons cache. Hassan's got missiles. They're American. All right, the next mission takes us to Amsterdam, where we finally meet up with Gaz and Captain Price, and this is where the first of the trophies come into play. This one took some patience since you have to eliminate all of the enemies to complete. We went in a counterclockwise manner around the area slowly picking everyone off until the patrol boat was all that was left. One down. <laughs> got the crocodile one. Now I got the Nessie one. Yes. Gaz and Price find out these goons are from the Mexican Las Almas cartel. We take a quick Syringe. detour to the red light district in Not Amsterdam and then sex in Call of Duty. Welcome to my world. Now meet one of the most badass new characters COD has developed in the last three years. Straight up, Alejandro is daddy, just like Pedro Pascal. I'm your daddy. We play as Rodolfo and we climb over the border wall into the US to de-escalate some situations, get blown up, shot, and lit on fire. Soap and Ghost show up to help hunt down Hassan. Call me Soap, Lieutenant. Last one says they call you Ghost. Actually, I believe he prefers to How to. And someone tell me what Soap was gonna call Ghost down in the comments. Maybe if you like this video, hit that like and sub button too. This mission is where I completed the third achievement. This was easy. Literally aim at the window and spray. Got it. While being chased by the Mexican army and Los Almos cartel, they got a hit on Hassan. Mexican Special Forces, 141, they are your brothers now. I guess we'll see Graves and Shadow Company at the family cookout. After shooting invincible enemies from the sky, they captured Hassan. Shut the fuck up! Where he said some of the truest words about some of the world's superpowers. You're the commander of a foreign terror organization. I can say the same to you. Where'd you get American missiles from? I don't care who they're from, I want to know where they're going. Why is that? Next, we're with Laswell, Gaz, and Price off the coast of Spain in a mission that is a nod to the greatest COD mission ever. All gillied up. Bravo, how copy? There are two sniper sections where you have to pick off enemies without setting off the alarm. Rather easy, but you have to reposition to get collateral headshots. 
Smoked him. Luckily, the section in between them where you go to clear the two buildings doesn't affect the challenge. Found something. Seriously, Carl, have you had your eyes checked recently? Got him. Good shit. It's just him. Smoked him. Then the cartel and Hassan's forces seize Laswell on the boat and capture her. Fuck! What the fuck? I can't see what's happening! Yo, you remember that badass bitch Farah and her friend Nikolai? The gang chases down Laswell, queuing two achievement challenges in the first game-breaking glitch. Easy as that. But this requires you to play the mission twice or restart because. Why now? Why now? Why now? Why now? It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. Why now? Mimi. Near the end of the mission, you have to fight an APC and board it. And I swear, I was about to gouge my eyes out with a rusty spoon. Every time I tried, the game just kept glitching and did this. Restarting the mission fixed the issue, but come on, Infinity Ward. This game has been out for more than five months. They rescue Kate, and she proves why she's a badass, too. Kate! Get the shot up! Well clear! Kate! Move! No! Soap and Alejandro infiltrate the house of El Sinambre's lieutenant, where we meet every COD BDSM simp's wet dream. Valeria. Everybody was simping. After the interrogation, we have... This is a denied area. Fuck. There's this way. Doors open. All teams were moving on the penthouse. Stand by. <laughs> ah, there it is. There are only three safes in the game, and one is in this dude's massive house. My dumbass didn't think to do it while I did the last trophy, so I had to restart the mission. Here's a little more Valeria for you weirdos. There it is. Bingo. Using your snake, you find out that El Sinambre is Valeria. I don't schedule. Jefe, hay que movernos. Mira, pendejito de mierda, estoy trabajando. It's been a ruse all along. El Sinambre. Valeria. Hiding in plain sight. Hiding. One for one makes the arrest, and we find out Alejandro knows her. Valeria. I know her. If this game is one thing, it's damn good at making the villains say truthful shit. As long as there is a war on terror, there will be no real war on drugs. To find your so-called terrorists and your missiles, you need me. She gives up the location of the remaining missiles on an oil rig and a boat, which brings us two more trophies. Ghost. A smart man would say to do this on an easier difficulty, and I would say to that, I'm stupid! I shot him. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it. They fall. The lads get to the deck and use the rocket commands to blow up the oil rig and create the largest OSHA violation the world has ever seen. When they get back to Las Almas, Graves show how small his peen really is and steals Alejandro's base and locks up his Los Vaqueros in jail. Kudos to Infinity Ward for this sly shit. Do this. I'm calling Shepard. General Shepard sends his regards. He told me all wouldn't take this well. He knows about this. The group starts a fight ending up with soap all alone. 
Graves and Shadow Company started killing civilians all over Los Almas while searching for one for one. And this mission highlights some sweet survival mechanics we all thought would be in DMZ, but Infinity Ward blue balled us. With this mission came the two remaining safes for the Gentleman Thief achievement. Too easy. But also, so I couldn't fire a gun or the crossbow you find, but I could use crafted items and knives. That was tough. It was fucking annoying. We made it, LT. They go to Alejandro's stash house and find Rodolfo and head to the prison complex to free Alejandro and the Los Vaqueros. This mission has three achievements. Honestly, I think this one is busted, or I don't know how to track time. Either way, I'll take it. Clear, go. No. Can't put up a fight. Go for the LT. Four last to give us chase. Ooh, I did get it. Nice. So it doesn't count the times when you die. Honestly, I just chaotically scrambled to try and complete these two. That's one. There we go. Price and Gaz got word from Laswell about Graves and Shepard, so they came to help Exfil. The boys are back in town. We're then thrown in a flashback where we play as a Shadow Company merc yep, 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 yep. who was on orders to deliver the ballistic missiles, but then they got ambushed and robbed by some Russian PMCs. You hit this. Why? We all keep secrets, Captain. Shepard goes on an ego trip trying to explain why he hid this from 141 in Laswell and explained he might be a furry. To do good, you've got to do some bad. When we shit, we bury it. That's how it works. Oh, yeah, cat. Price gives this wanker a proper warning. I'm coming for you. Then the squad forms the most coolest, awesome super squad known to man. Ghost team. And then they go after Graves. Can't say shit. Gotta love bug games, man. The tunnel portion of this mission is the only part without spoilers because, well, I, I couldn't see anything. This uh, bug where I see lights through walls is super annoying. Oh, there was also an issue where the load screen would freeze for long periods of time or Jesus. crash the game if you died. The end of the mission is where the next achievement comes in. Yeah, Graves brought a fucking tank. Graves, being the wimp that he is, brought a tank to a gunfight. So while running around shooting these targets, you're evading fire from him and his big man tanky tank. Every time you die, it resets the achievement too. Yay. Don't lose count or you'll end up like me, running around looking for the last one. There we go. After that, we roast his ass with some C4. The team regroups and Valeria tells them where Hassan took the last missile. Chicago. In Chicago, Price and Soap scale down the side of the building where Hassan is located, which brings us to the last challenge achievement of the campaign. Honestly, I was surprised this was so easy for the last mission to do during the campaign. You just had to be quick and plan your shots. But who on the sound team missed this on editing? Bravo 3, 5-5 five, five secure. Copy, 4-5-5, five, five, make an entry. That sounded like Graves. Alright, alright, alright. I messed up. But, it was still easy. At the end of the mission, Soap is weaponless again, but has the missile control pad. You've got to run around, making gadgets again, and disarm the missile while evading Hassan and his men. Soap gets captured and almost thrown out a window, but luckily Ghost is in the right spot at the right time providing overwatch. Perfect show, LT. You called it, Sergeant. Then the gang goes for drinks afterwards like nothing even happened. And Ghost even wore his new, old, mask out in public. Totally not like a weirdo. Who is he? They get a tip about an old enemy. <sighs> Makarov.
For some reason, the number 17 complete the campaign and the number 18 complete the campaign on veteran or higher achievement didn't show a card, although I did get them. Now that the campaign is finished, it's on to step two. The Spec Up Missions. This is where the pain starts. If you're into that kind of thing, you're in luck. There are six trophies that require friends. Well, five and one that's grueling but better solo. The random queue experience in co-op is exactly what you would expect. I'm over here. There's a button you have to press. Right here. Look towards the ramp. Not the door, the ramp. Right here in the center. Look where I'm looking. There you go. Let's go B. My teammate had no mic and died instantly and backed out, so I did this one to start off. Bruh, what are you doing? Why are you just laying on the floor like that? Had my fill of random queuing, so I recruited my friend Rivalent to complete some of these missions. Things started off promising. Is that a date? Yeah, bro. Of course. Oh, sick, dude. Bro date, bro date. <laughs> bro date. Do we make out at the end? Is that okay? I no, kiss dude, at on the, the end, first date. At the end, bro. At the end, bro. It's, it's a bro job at the end. But once we got into the mission, things started going downhill, and I wondered if he was up to the task. I didn't know you were coming with me. Yeah, well... You didn't seem to be following the plan. I didn't know you were going A. <laughs> it's all right. We can split up after this. Asshole. All right, Good pick time. it up. All right, now um, you go to C. I'll go to B. Let's secure the others before AQ realizes this one. Motherfucker. You want? Oh my God! There was a clay. <laughs> God, God damn it! Fuck you guys. He was shooting at me. What do you want me to do? Hug him? Maybe. That's what he needs. I mean, everybody needs a hug now and again. Oh, oh my God. Yep. Yep. That happened. That's all the way at B. But then he clutched up after I was down by a juggernaut. Holy juggernaut. I'm dead. You might as well just die. <laughs> no, shut up, quitter. <laughs> you spit too. <laughs> Why is he just straight up charging me? If I die right now, I swear to God. Found it. He's gonna kill everybody. Is that, yes. is that our exfil? What is he doing? On the way to exfil, we ran into a problem. The exfil helicopter pilot either decided to take the scenic route, or he was having confidence problems. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Bro, bro what are? is he doing? Is he getting distracted by the smoke? Like, there is nobody even coming either. What in tarnation? Is it the car? Is the car throwing you off? You're gonna make us get loose. Breaker one gets the LZ. This is gonna be a tight window. Oh, super tight, guys. Tight window. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> this, this can't be real. Like, are you coming? Is he finally coming? Finally. God damn. Oh my god, dude. Let's get out of here. We, are RTB we probably didn't get it. Cargo secure. Mission accomplished. We keep like shrinking and getting bigger. Yo, we did get it. We got both. Hell yeah. This mission required us to destroy SAM missiles and then exfil. Easy, right? It'll like still count towards this one. Well, I guess that's how we. Never mind. Take it a little quieter. <laughs> you were the one that sprinted, and that guy was right there. Maybe it wasn't the bullet that was whizzing past his face, and it just no, it happened wasn't to be at the same the time. Face. It had a forty-five degree angle from that man, oh, so there was oh. no way it was whizzing past his face. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. That well, this video game likes to pretend like it's realistic, <laughs> and so therefore he would not that he would not have known about that bullet. Totally. Totally. You're right. Right. Because also the suppressor. The logic also checks out. Right. 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 Because also the suppressor would not be making my weapon as quiet as it is right now. I'll take the dude on the left. You take the dude on the right. Okay. Three, two, one. Wow. Two shots. The whole way through, this was absolute chaos, and we were freaking out the entire time. Oh my god. 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 No. I, I had a p no. Oh, I went. Oh, oh, bro. We were over time anyways. <laughs> that was the hardest fucking one. <laughs> I'm out of ammo. <laughs> I got the jug. All right, I got him. I can't fucking get out of here. Why am I not turning left? Oh, go down already. Why doesn't that crash? He's just spinning Oh my around. god. Dude. I'm going down. <laughs> this game is so... <laughs> it's just spinning. He's just spinning. <laughs> He's still there! Go on without me! <laughs> 
where do we exfil? Oh no. Oh shit! The nade launcher, bro! Fuck! It like landed at my feet. We gotta run. Oh shit! Are you fucking kidding me? Oh my god, bro. How do I take my- Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Do you have armor? Man, we got a fucking helo, bro, and I don't have a- I don't, Oh my god. Fuck, we're so fucked, dude. We're so Why is this oh one so god. much harder? That's the- That's our shitty truck. Oh, <laughs> oh my god, dude. I'm gonna have to leave you for a minute. Hold on. I'm gonna have to leave you. Oh no, mine! <laughs> no. <laughs> Maybe it'll restart us there. We have two and a half minutes. Where the fuck do we go? What? Oh my god, I'm going the wrong way. Yo, would that little me, me be faster? This thing sound like the tire is constantly dragging. I guess it probably is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't wait to shit meme this game. Oh no. Oh, okay. Phew. Oh shit! It's gonna be a hot exfil, boys. At least 16 minutes. 16 minutes. Did we get it? 13. <gasps> Hell ride, yeah, we got it. Oh, no. oh my god! Oh my god! Yes. <laughs> we were so. <laughs> oh my god! Holy shit! This instantly started off bad because the enemy wave planted a bomb right at the beginning. Does that count as one? That they planted that shit so I quick? think so. Oh my god, dude. Then my dumbass accidentally started wave two early. Right, oh I shit, I just started it. Although we held our own. In wave three, they planted the their fuck? second bomb. We gotta go okay. defuse it. Wait, no, I'll stay at C, I'll stay at C. Yeah, yeah, whatever. But wave good? four and five, we zoomed through easy uh -huh. peasy. Look at the truck. Oh. I, got I, like, I got him. The final wave was the most chaotic, and I had to use a missile to take out a jug. Looks like they're pushing A. I'm gonna go hit up A. Oh, I just blew up this heli. They're on B. I'm gonna take out this jug with this with Predator missile. Oh, we yeah, closed that, up dude, shop. We no only sweat. got two, right? Yeah, that was only two. Two bombs. Do this. I got it. Now, this is what it all comes down to. The final achievement. I stupidly decided to try and complete this trophy with randoms at first, and you can guess how that turned out. Luke, I'm your father. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta do this without setting off an alarm. Do something for us. Okay, get in this building, okay? We have to get the thingy, okay? And then we could die, okay? Oh, the, the, thingy the, and then we could die. But the alarm's off already. That's the problem. Yeah. I then recruited the help of my friend Joel, and we ended up completing the mission, but it didn't pop the trophy. I did some digging and found out that you had to do it all in one playthrough and can't hit the retry button. With that knowledge, I loaded into one last match and made sure the random wouldn't play with me. Just gonna sit here and not move until he leaves. There we go. Now that Pepper Cortez was out of my hair, I was able to get to work. Build the positivo. Good eye. Got one objective. Please be in this building. It is. Good Fuck eye. yeah. Yes. I got it! Yes. Fuck yeah, that took way longer than it should have.